over 10 years, Carolina Improv at Uptown Theater has been making us laugh. Right now I'm joined by the lovely Gina. So good to see you. Good to see you. Thanks for being here. Of course. So things are a little bit different for you guys right now. The doors are closed, but that really hasn't slowed you all down. Talk to us about yeah, what you're doing. Yeah, it slowed us down a little bit because we can't actually have people in our space right now, but we've had to improvise, so to speak, <laughs> and take things online. So what we're doing right now is we're bringing our classes online because a lot of people come through here and take classes. We do a lot of corporate training with organizations where we take this concept of improv into businesses of like how to move quickly, how to ch how to deal with change. <laughs> Anybody dealing That's with change right, right now. I so know. we take all of that into businesses, but now we're doing it all online. Uh, we haven't taken our shows online yet because I just haven't 100%, I'm not sold on it yet, but we do have a YouTube channel, so we're pushing people to go watch us on YouTube while we patiently wait <laughs> for our governor to bless us and open us. And of course, you're eager to get the doors back open, so for people that have never experienced mm -hmm. this before, you have to check it out. I mean, it's so interactive, right? It is so interactive. I'd love to get you on stage. It would probably <laughs> be so fun with you. So people come to the show. We ask them for suggestions. We don't have a script. And they give us a suggestion. And then we create an entire show without a script based on the audience suggestion. So a lot of times people are scared. They're like, oh, are you going to put me on the spot? Are you going to put me on stage? This isn't stand-up comedy. So everybody needs to understand that improv is an ensemble teamwork experience, similar to whose line is it anyway. So we are literally improvising without a script, and all of our performers are homegrown. They're all from the Grand Strand area. Oh, my gosh. So much positively local right here. I mean, you really are positive. It doesn't local. get more local than this. <laughs> Even when people move here from, like, New York or other big cities, and they're like, oh, I've done improv in New York can I come do it there? I'm like, only if you take classes here because we believe in promoting people up and you shouldn't just be able to show up and do a show. You need to be part of our culture. Gina, thank you so much. Friends, remember to check out Carolina Improv right here at Myrtle Beach Mall. But in the meantime, you can find them online.